Hi everyone, this is Liv again from wildplantforager.com. I'm autumn foraging and this is burdock. There are actually two varieties here. We have the small variety and then we have big brother, greater burdock, which has huge leaves that personally, personally I like to use for wrapping flowers in when I'm gathering these, especially on a hot day because this will keep them cooler for a longer time. And then we have here the seeds, which as many of you know, are very, very sticky. This is actually where the Velcro company got its inspiration. Did you know that? Pretty cool, huh? Now, these little hooks are very effective for spreading the seeds, but um, they're not so nice to eat. You can eat the seeds though, so I'm gathering them now and I'm going to do a little, little experiment. I'm going to sprout them. So this way I can discard off the hooks and eat the greens. I can eat them as microgreens or as a sprout. So it even sticks to my skin, do you see that? That is just so amazing. And then you can also eat a root. Let me show you, I've been digging up one here. This is a small one, this is really a baby. If you want to dig bigger roots, this will be an adventure you will never forget, especially in clay soil. Um, but the roots are actually sold in stores sometimes as gobo. This is uh, a root in Japan, they eat this a lot. So here it is and it's very nourishing, it's very rich in minerals, very good if in winter time you want to provide your body with some extra minerals. So you can have the root and the seeds. So this was me and Burdock. Like us on Facebook, visit our website wildplantforager.com and get more recipes and inspiration. Bye!